honey. Hey, would you shut that thing up? Hey, please don't call him that. Yeah, well, I'm trying to get some shut eye, okay? So your dumb little soccer baby is grossing my sleep schedule out. She's just a toddler, honey. She just is scared to sleep on her own. She has nightmares. Hey, brother, never call me honey again. That's gross. And the only nightmare is that ugly kid of yours. You know what? Give that to me. I'm gonna abuse it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Do not come down here. That is unacceptable. <sighs> Give me that kid. Hey! Stop beating my balls! No, I will not. Please, honey, just look at me. Just look at me. Just look at me. I will not be tempted by your seductive ways, brother. I'm not into incest, but please just leave her alone. But I just want to sleep. I'll put her in her room and we'll go to sleep. Okay. happened. Her first period. The hell did you just say? I'm so sorry, honey. You'll make it through it. The hell she will. Come on, honey. What's wrong? She disgusts me. <clears throat> and don't call me honey, brother. <clears throat> Leave her be. She's just becoming a woman. I don't want the smell of her womanly concoctions in my house. Stop calling it that. What? Concoction. It's a concoction by witches. It's disgusting. No. Are you okay? How dare you? How dare I what? I just... Don't want our little girl to grow up. She already has. Look, sometimes I just get so angry that it's present time after the past when the ball was a baby and now she's a teenager. It just makes me mad and I want to hit her. You can't just hit teenagers. That's not okay. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah.
Hey, what was she, she, what was she doing on the computer in here anyways? Huh? How about I check it out? You disgust me. I'm not ready to look at stuff like that yet. I don't care if you're a baby. Teenager. I'm going to beat you and then I'm gonna hit your mommy. No! Please don't hit her and her mommy! Please! It's too late for you, teenage daughter. And you freak of nature. You're next. Ah! Ah! No, please! Wait, I'm cold! Give me a second. Okay, I'm ready. You disgust me. You look halfway like our daughter. You punched my hoodie off! I'm going to bed. Better not make a sound. Night. Honey? It's morning. I'm gonna wake up. Oh, it's morning time. Oh, I had the weirdest nightmare last night. I want to tell you about it. Let me check my dream journal, because I wrote it down when I was dreaming. Well, I mean, I also keep a dream journal, um, and I'm also back in bed. Uh, but yeah, let's check your dream journal. Here it is. Yep. Yep. Hollow's, Hollow's Eve night. Daughter Ball came in with a knife and stared at me. Omin ominously. Anyways, let me just close this up and we can have breakfast. I wonder if that's a premonition dream. Hmm. some dream. Alright, breakfast time. You know, honey, you're... My brother had the craziest dream last night. Yeah, I really did. It was kind of scary. It gave me the chills. Anyways, darling, you would never do anything to hurt me creepily, right? I've never done anything wrong to you. Right? Right?
Anyways. Ugh. I'm just so angry that you spooked me in my subconscious realm. Ah! Honey, you broke my milk glass. Yeah, and next I'll break what your milk glass is good for. Your bones. Well, um, well, scientifically, milk doesn't even have, like, a ton of calcium. It's, like, like mildly good for your bones. So. Oh, yeah, well, you know what they say. Smarts get the broken bones. Ah! What are you looking at? I'm going to the wine cellar to get some wine. Have fun with your milk, nerd. Finally, the wine cellar. That was weird, it's... It's locked! It's locked! I can't get out! Help! Brother! Is that you yelling? Yes. I'm coming! <sighs> Why were you locked down there? It was our whore daughter. You! Yeah, you! How could she have locked you down there? She doesn't know how doors work. Oh, I think she knows more about doors than she leads Let's On about. Let's On about. She doesn't know about doors. Or any... Oh, she's gonna get it now. <laughs> Stop beating the balls! Please! Give her back! Ah! Ah! She bit off my arm! Oh, my arm. Watch it fall slowly Frat girl still trying to get even Hate is mad for whatever reason Smoke in the air, binge drinking They lose it when the DJ drops a needle How did you do that? She's a bad kid a demon child at that. Like, you were, you were intimate with that one ball and the, the, the ball gave you a, a disgusting child and a, a, a gross, disfigured baby, to be more precise. And like, then it kind of, it developed into this creepy baby and it watched me sleep and like, you know, it even watched me slumber. To be precise, I mean, at the end of the day, the ball daughter is disgusting, quite repulsive. Well, one, what she just did was not that bad. Okay, well, one, 
it doesn't hurt as bad as you're leading it on to be. Yeah. Ooh. Ow, my arm. It hurts so bad, I think I need a hospital. An ambulance at that. Yeah, a hospital. They can give me one of their concoctions to fix my, my arm. It could maybe grow back. Oh, hospital, please fill me up with your concoction. Okay, well, firstly, first of all, um, you're gonna be fine. You need to be a, a man and, um, just, I don't know, rub some dirt on it. And, um, and firstly, um, it's not her fault. She's just defending me because she loves me. A, it is that bad. And B, Fine. You're right. I can be a man about it. But not because you said so. Because it doesn't even hurt that bad. Good. Because I'm sick and tired of your malarkey. What'd you say to me? Ugh! I can't reach you! Well, it seems like you've learned a valuable lesson today about beating your wife. Brother. Brother. But... Uh, maybe you're right. Maybe I am beginning to value my brother a bit more. But you, through the lessons of horror, I was so scared because of the dream. I may never rest well again either because of the infection. And I've learned that I can't just let my my brother beat me up and and beat up my kid and that I need to be strong. Who? Um what did I say? Uh my my kid. Who the f who is Mike? Who's Mike Id? Um Yeah, my kid, you know. I don't, I'm not going to go to the hospital, but like, maybe I, I should just, I'm going to go grab my key to the, to the car. Uh, who was that? The, the, the doctor, or? I was going to get my key. Yeah, I mean, I don't know if there's like a cultural disconnect, but like, who is, um, who is, who is Mikey? Uh, you know, uh, uh, oh. good talk. <laughs> yeah, see you around. Brother, I think you should get some rest. That looks like that might be painful without an arm. I think, I think rest would do some good. I'm gonna go to bed. <laughs> I forgot. You know, my arm. Oh no. Let me. For you, brother. Thanks a lot, man. Really helped a lot. <gasps> My arm. Oh no! Now you have no arms! Yeah. And, you know, like a week ago, I'd probably be pretty upset, but I think I've learned a lesson that 
life isn't about the arms. It's about... I'm so glad you've realized this, brother. Can you get some sleep? <laughs> Not this time. I'm awake. It's morning time. Oh, I'm awake. Also, brother, brother. Ah, my arms are hurting. I think I'm going to die. Don't die, brother. I think I would like to see a sunset before I die. But it's 9.15 a.m. Yes, a sunset before I die. I okay. Brother, I'm dying. Brother, it's so cold. It's so cold. I'm dying. Dying. No. Mom? Mom! No. All I needed was a concoction. Oh no, I think that guy is dying in that field at sunset. No! Brother. It's Ablo? It's Ablo. OMG, <laughs> yeah. Like, good, good day, good morning, I think. I can say, je m'appelle David, but that's probably it. When you learn a language, you want to actually nah. use it. Babbel is designed with that goal in mind. This year is my year to get fluent in Spanish, and Babbel is definitely going to help me do that. The app is so easy to use, and it's so practical. It helps you learn things that you will actually need. So it's my husband is from Language Today. That's B-A-B-B-E-L dot com. Uh -huh. There's only one station in Denver built for every listener. Hey, Oh hi honey. I was just taking I was just taking brother to uh you know. Yeah, that's all. Well, you know, despite all of our our, our quarrels in the past, we, we do really love each other, and we ended up ending as friends. Honey, what's wrong?
is it about them? I must be missing something. They just keep doing nothing. So intoxicated to be scared. Better off without them. They're nothing but unstable. Bring ashtrays to the table.